Hell y'all. Yeah, I'm going to be reading out of Psalm 111. It says, Praise the Lord. I will extol the Lord with all my heart in the counsel of the upright and in the assembly. Great are the works of the Lord. They are pondered by all who delight in them. Glorious and majestic are his deeds, and his righteousness endures forever. He has caused his wonders to be remembered. The Lord is gracious and compassionate. He provides food for those who fear him. you got to fear the God. He remembers his covenant forever. He remembers it forever. Think about that. He has shown his people the power of his works, given them the lands of other nations. The works of his hands are faithful and just. All his precepts are trustworthy. They are steadfast forever and ever, done in faithfulness and uprightness. He provided redemption for all his people. He ordained his covenant forever. Holy and awesome is his name. The fear of the Lord is the beginning of wisdom. All who follow his precepts have good understanding. To him belongs eternal praise. Just think if Congress followed that. Just think, especially, the fear of the Lord is the beginning of wisdom. Congress could get a lot of wisdom from that. All who follow his precepts have good understanding. Think about it. If Congress followed his precepts, they would have good understanding. To him belongs eternal praise. They would get eternal praise then if they followed what God says to do. There would be no confusion. There would be less stress. This country would be running like a fine um, oiled machine. It would be if they just followed these precepts. But they don't. They keep going away from the Bible. That's what they like to do. But, and, and guess what happens? It doesn't end up very well for them. Anyways, you have a blessed day.